So when Android released Android 12, there were a lot of new features that were introduced to us and in this video I'm just going to be sharing with you some battery tips and tricks that will help you improve your devices. So if you are new here, just give the video a thumbs up, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and without further ado, let's just dive into the video. So first of all, what I want to share with you is called the extra dim feature. So you can see the extra dim feature right here is turned on and when you just turn it off, your phone is going to go brighter. When you turn it off, it's going to dim your screen of your phone, which I think is one of the best features I've seen so far on Android 12. And you can just press hold on it to just go to the settings right here. And then you can tweak the intensity of the extra dim to even make it go dimmer when you just turn it on. So when I just scroll this side like this, you can see my phone turns dim very dim whilst i turn this on and when i turn it off you're going to see my phone is brighter when i turn it on you see my phone is very dim and this can help improve the battery life of your device because you probably might be out or maybe your battery might be running very low and you want to just get some battery to do some couple of few things you can just turn this feature on and it's going to help you improve the battery life of your device so depending on however way you want your tweak your intensity to be it depends on however you feel you want it you can just tweak it out here and then it's going to help you out you can scroll down to just get the extra dim shortcut on your device and then it's going to be like this so anytime you have it on your device you can scroll like like this and when you tap on it like this it's just going to activate the extra dim when you tap on it like this it's just going to deactivate it so anyhow you feel you want this feature to be working for you or anyhow you think you want to activate this feature it depends on you you can just put it up here and then that's going to be very helpful the next feature which i think is going to be very helpful for you to improve your battery life is the extreme battery saver so with the extreme battery saver when you tap on battery saver like this it's going to give you the chance to activate extreme battery saver by giving you a notification right here and when you tap on it it's going to give you the chance to post some applications pay your settings you feel like you want so if you want to just know the applications you want to pause you can tap on this money settings right here and it's going to give you the chance to put in some essential apps you feel like you want right here and anytime you activate this it's going to just pause those applications and then unpause the ones you put them right here so you can just check on these applications right here anytime you activate extreme battery saver these apps are going to still work so when you check out right here i have some applications in this category where even when i just change my settings to extreme battery saver they are still gonna work so right now i'm gonna just turn this feature on and you're gonna see how it's gonna pause the applications i have on my device and how it's gonna unpause some applications i really want them to work while it's still in this mode and this feature is very helpful because there are some applications which works in the background and with this feature activated you're gonna see that the applications are gonna be grayed out right here and they are not gonna work so when you check out this google photos and then the pl app right here you're gonna see that this app when i tap on it it's gonna ask me to unpause it before it will work and when i unpause it it's gonna unpause temporarily and give it some few minutes after a while it's gonna give me a notification that this app is gonna pause again which is very very cool so when i unpause this app I'm going to be able to use it while the other ones are still paused right here so with this extreme battery saver it allows applications paused and you can see here right here these applications are the unpaused ones and these ones are all paused and you can check out right here they are all grayed up right here that's when you just tap on it it's going to ask you to just unpause it before they work and it wouldn't drain your battery it will just keep your battery very very strong and then make it last a bit longer than it used to be so let's check out the next feature the next on the list is the ability to pause some applications whilst they are not in use or whilst you think maybe they are draining your battery so when you see the pl app right here the premier league app i can press hold on this app like this and it's going to give me these options right here and i can tap on this one right here and the app is going to be grayed out right here and you can see it's been paused and when i tap on it like this it's going to tell me the app has been paused and i can just unpause this application right away if i want to use it if i don't want to use it i can just tap on this and it's not going to unpause it so there are some applications which this pause and on pause feature works on but there are some applications they don't work on but with those that don't work on you are entitled to just go into the app like this by pressing hold on it and then tapping on this eye right here and then when you scroll down in the app you can just go to the battery side of the app like this and then when you go there you're gonna see some three options right here we have unrestricted optimized and then restricted so with unrestricted it allows the app to just run in the background and with the optimize it optimizes the app you are using per how you use the app or other applications on your device and it's actually not gonna really run in the background per how you use your apps on your devices often so and with this restricted right here this is where the application is not gonna run on the background and then you it will probably run when you just enter into application or you start using the application that is when it comes in place so i think every time you just have to put it on optimize which you are going to get notifications and then it's going to behave normally but it wouldn't really drain your battery but with the unrestricted 
which is one of the settings i only advise you to use because it's gonna just drain your battery and it wouldn't make it last longer but if you are out there and then maybe you don't want your battery to drain very quickly you are not you are far from home and then you wouldn't get home very early you can put it on restricted for the meantime so that the app will just restrict the background usage of your battery and all and then that's gonna help you so let's check out the next feature too yeah so with the final one i want to share with you you just have to go to your battery settings by pressing hold on your battery saver or go to your settings and then go to battery and then you are going to find this you tap on adaptive preferences and then you're going to see this one right here i would advise you to every time put this on adaptive preferences and this works more like the previous one i showed you guys so the battery is actually going to help adapt the way you use your device or the way you use applications on your phone and then it will improve on your battery life so if you are a heavy user the battery is actually going to optimize itself and then know how to just use the battery whilst you are using your applications and it wouldn't make it drain your battery very much and putting it on adaptive battery it would actually tell you that some of the notifications and background apps are not going to come in quickly like it used to be and it's actually going to be delayed so it will just optimize it the way it will just not drain the battery i think that is very helpful and it will make us get a longer battery life on our devices so if these tips and tricks are very helpful just give this video a thumbs up so that it reaches a lot of people and then also don't forget to subscribe to the channel so that you don't miss any new video i create on this channel and you can check out this video right here it's actually going to help you know more about android 12 and without further ado i'm just going to catch you in the next video Peace.